All right, Dad, here's the, uh, the V913. Um, like I was telling you about, it's, it's pretty big. Um, see if I can get the whole thing in there. I've got my camera kind of mounted weird so I can film this while I fly it. But uh, you can see I kind of scuffed it up right there when it crashed once. I beat up the tip of the nose pretty good when I crashed. I um, also broke this skid here. Um, had to glue it back on. I replaced this motor, this is the main motor, and then uh, also replaced the tail motor back there. And I had to, like I said, I had to cut the little cage out that goes back there and just zip tie it. It's kind of ghetto, but hey, it works. Um, I was telling you about uh, the little servo arms, and you can see them, you know, there, there's one of them here, a little clear or white plastic deal, and there's one on the other side, you can probably see it better, and you can see where I've got the pins at, I've moved them to the outer thing. Well, let's go ahead and plug it in here and turn it on and show you getting it flying. So you can go ahead and turn it on. And Set it down on a flat surface. Let's see, yeah, you can see that from there. I'm going to go ahead and turn on my transmitter, but real quick before I do so. So there's your, you know, your rotational trim, your throttle trim, your forward and backwards trim, and then your your uh, side to side trim. On mine, I've got a button up here, and that'll switch it from high to low mode. High mode gives it a little more. Uh, thrust if when you're going forward or backwards and if you're in the high mode um, it might work also in the low mode but when you're in high mode definitely and you hit this one when you're giving it some direction it goes like turbo it gives it all it's got and that's when that thing really gets flying so go ahead and turn it on here and that kind of made a movement now just check make sure those things are working now I give it just a couple of clicks up, it kind of wants to rotate a little bit. I don't know if you can kind of see that, how it's kind of already starting to rotate slightly. And I'm going to give it a little more, it wants to kind of slide to the left, so I'm going to give it a little right rudder and stop it. Okay, I'm going to turn around. So I'm going to give it some controlled throttle, I'm going to up one, that's one click, two clicks. So if I give it to the left, it's going to kill my tail rotor. See that? Because it's wanting the, the rotation of the main rotor to go ahead and give it, let it turn. And if I turn it to the right, it's going to speed up that tail rotor and get it to bounce around. But that's about it. Let me know if you have any questions.